I'm like, bro. Does he, he got a kid? Look at his back. Oh my god. <laughs> Welcome back to another reaction. That's the evening reacting to Jesse Lee Peterson, Savage Moments, man. This is his slut maker interview with, uh, I think it's Amber Rose. Yeah. <laughs> I always wanted to see this, so I think I always seen like a little clip, the little long part. So let us know whether Jesse Lee Peterson videos you want to see down in the comments. It's the Road Doing Case. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, bro. We'll be fine. I'll run into this. Let's go. Like, well, if going out on a date with a guy makes me a slut, then that's just what I'm going to be. I don't think. Going out on a date makes you a slut, but having sex with different men makes you makes you a slut. Well, what does it make you if you have sex with different women? A slut maker. Men don't want sluts as wives and mothers of their children. Who cares? I don't care. You can't live your life for no man. It's not about men. Who cares about men? If I sat here and lived my life for a man, I would be men. <laughs> But you do understand that a man would not want a slut to be the mother of the children. That's not true because... Not real men. That's not true. I, I, I feel like for most men, that's probably true. But I feel like it goes both ways, definitely. Definitely goes both ways. You can't be a hypocrite about this shit, guys. A lot of the same shit, like, these females is out here horny like us. Maybe even hornier. So if you expect her to hold it down, man, you gotta give up that same energy. You gotta have that same type of energy if these are the kind of people you're looking for. If you want a lawyer relationship, you gotta be loyal yourself. If that's the type of demon you got in you, where you like to cheat on motherfuckers, well, that's the type of energy you're gonna uh, attract. What is a real man, Jesse? What is a real man? You? Uh, yes. I think it's perfect. <laughs> so when you're married and the woman is angry and you're angry, how would you solve the problem? Well, what is it? What is it? Well, I don't get the same respect that white Americans get uh -huh. from from people in general. Are you serious? And why not? Why not? Because I'm a black male and I'm an educated black male. I'm a threat. What are you talking about? Who are you a threat to? I'm a threat to anybody. Are you a threat to white people? I'm a threat to them. I'm a threat to you. Are you a threat to me? Like, so you feel like you're a threat? I, 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 feel, I feel that any time that you... You don't even look I, like a threat. I, I don't... <laughs> know if I'm, if I'm, not with that, that damn jacket on. It's, it's not the fact that... Watching. You too yeah. nice of a guy to live that way. You walk them down the street, maybe you see somebody walking down and have any legs and they have a shopping cart and they're trying to push them so you can survive. You might feel sad about it or something. I, I, I was like, wow, that person is walking with no legs, pushing a cart. Leaving <laughs> <laughs> heavily on the cart. <laughs> No, that's not a good one either because feeling sorry for the person walking down the street pushing a car is not going to help them. Yeah, well, I, I know what you mean, but I mean, I'm thinking of situations where you might feel sorry for somebody. I don't see where it's that bad. You can't show me, you got to show me where it's bad. I don't quite get that. Before. Because it doesn't do good for you, it just makes you feel bad. <laughs> and it's not doing anything for them, it's not causing them to get legs, no. <laughs> to grow legs. <laughs> Are you wicked at heart or good? Um, I, I think I think that we're, we're divided. We're like conflicted. Not we, but you. Me. And, uh, oh, are there more than one person in there? Which one are you? Neither. You're neither good nor evil. No. What are you? <laughs> neither of those. Just a just a being. Just, just a being. That's right. I don't know about that. How did that happen? <laughs> I don't know. How did you happen? <laughs> I'm sorry. How did you happen? This dude's confused. No, that's not the answer, buddy. <laughs> Bad side is out of my control. Is there a good side to you? Uh, the good side doesn't like the bad side. What is the good side to you? What uh, is this dude talking about? sees the bad and doesn't like it. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Amen, brother. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, I don't know what the hell that dude's talking about. The good and the bad side, you think you're inherently wicked. I don't think anybody's inherently wicked unless you're, like, born... A sociopath or whatever but even then like those dudes tend to be in, in like environments to where like they're like brutalized and shit like it's just like that's a weird. but uh yeah that one dude talking about i'm a threat i'm an educated black man i'm a threat threat to who man i think you're just a threat to yourself by keeping that dumbass mentality you're educated okay now you take the education and do something to benefit yourself now if you mean like you're a threat to someone's job because you, you're you have that type of work ethic if you're that kind of threat and that's good great yeah, uh, let me know if you want to see more Jesse Lee Peterson videos down in the comments. Make sure to like, button, subscribe, and share. We'll see you next time. Peace.